project's been many years in the making. At one point, I questioned if I'd live long enough to see it completed. <laughs> so I can tell you, I'm particularly happy to be here today for this dedication. <laughs> As president of Pathways for Keen, I'd like to tell you a little bit about who we are and what we do. Pathways is a nonprofit 501c3 organization dedicated to raising seed money for the development of alternative transportation trails here in Keene. Its beginning was in 1994 when uh, Chuck Redfern, John Summers, and Bill Apple got together and decided to organize to develop these trails. Since then, Pathways has raised over $300,000 and for the development of approximately seven miles of trails in this beautiful bridge. Our current project, which is the extension of the trail from the bridge out to Wickham's Mill Road, about 1.9 miles, is scheduled for completion uh, in early of June next year. In the near future, we hope to establish the trail to the Colony Mill uh, Center of Keene Properties and eventually to have our trails go from city limit to city limit. This bridge project, oh, I'm sorry, incidentally, I'd like to tell you that uh, Chuck Redfern and uh, John Summers are still on our Pathways board and are here today. Uh, so thank you, John. And, and, uh, project has been over a decade in the making, as with a bicycle chain of many lengths and has taken many people working together to get these projects completed. The bridge began in earnest when Congressman Bass secured a $571,000 grant. Thank you, Congressman Bass. Along the way, Senator Kelly stepped in and helped me so long at the state level. Thank you, Senator Kelly. Mayor Lane, Mayor Pregent, and Mayor Blastos, and all of our city council members were continuously supportive of this project. Thank you, mayors and city council. The Four of the Fourth event is a four-mile runner walk on the 4th of July. It is our principal fundraiser. A big thank you to the sponsors of the event, participants who made it possible for the Pathways to donate $100,000 towards the construction of the bridge. The economy these past few years has been very difficult. It bears witness to the quality of the businesses of Keene by their very generous support during these difficult times. And thank you to the increasing numbers of four and four participants. Your participation not only has helped pathways to raise money for the development of the trails, but also demonstrates the great public support for this type of project. Again, thank you sponsors and participants. And thank you to the Pathways Board members for their continuing <coughs> efforts. There are two people in particular whose support made this bridge possible. The first person whose vision of Keene helps make us very proud of the special place it is. Throughout the planning process, when we encountered what seemed like insurmountable problems, stepped in and found solutions. We are indeed very fortunate to have John McLean as our city manager. Thank you, John. The second person on this project, uh, the second person took this project and made it his own. He is the one person in the Pathways organization who makes our fundraiser before and the fourth possible dedicated his all to getting the bridge built. Would you please give a big thank you to Tom Little. The building of this bridge has been a long and challenging project, but it has also shown what we can what can be accomplished when we all work together towards a worthy goal. There are some who say the bridge is a boondoggle and will never warrant the cost. I say, prove those couch potatoes wrong. <laughs> I challenge you to not only use this bridge, but to wear it out. Thank you. 